Well, you know, as we enter closer to Christmas this year, it really reminds all of us that the season of giving is really about helping others. The staff at Riley Hospital for Children offers that help every day to thousands of children. And tonight, our Sunrise anchor, Ben Hill, met a Greenwood family who turned to Riley when their son was only weeks old. Take a look. By all accounts, Mason Lee is a normal 10-year-old. <laughs> ah. Playing wide receiver with his dad as quarterback. But this is as close to actual football Mason can play. He had open heart surgery when he was just three and a half weeks old. Mason's mom, Melissa, was going through a range of emotions. Fearful, anxious, scared. However, she had uh, hope. Knowing that he was going to receive care at Riley, there was an, a, a sense of assurance. We knew we were going to one of the best children's hospitals in the world, and we were thankful that we were just a couple miles away. Mason was born with a rare congenital heart defect called truncus arteriosus. Mason's heart was missing a key artery that didn't allow his blood to be transported properly. Luckily for the Lee family, the surgery that saved his life was pioneered at Riley. The surgery was eight hours. One of the worst feelings you could have is not being in a position to help your, your child and, and seeing him uh, lying there in, in their little crib with tubes going everywhere. And, uh, it was difficult. Uh -oh. The procedure was a success. Now at 10, Mason loves running around with his new dog. He also loves playing with his buddies, but he always has to warn them. Um, that I have a heart problem and don't get rough. Mason will have to continue to have his conduit valve replaced every five to ten years for the rest of his life. His dad says he's handling it well, but admits that might change. I think part of that is um, being a ten-year-old boy. Uh, the, the, he doesn't have a lot of fear yet. Melissa credits the staff at Riley for always giving her hope. But we're always told at Riley that it's going to be okay. It might not be what you planned, but it's going to be okay. Even Mason has similar advice for other Riley patients. Don't get scared. It's going to be okay. Yeah. Ben Hill, Channel 13, Eyewitness News. Now remember, it's not too late to give back and make a difference. Riley Hospital could always use your help. Now to do that, you can go to RileyKids.org and make a donation today.